in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I forgot all mama taught and made my bed in hell. I had wandered far from home, as good as dead until the Lord remembered every prayer. My heart had dared to speak. Took me up on For our good night message on this Saturday, the 13th of January 2024, broadcasting from the Salesian Pontifical University, Rome, Italy, by your servant Father Eustace Siame, a Salesian of Don Bosco, we listen to this encouraging and inspiring message in the series Lessons to Live By, entitled lessons we cannot afford to miss in life one thing i've learned she will never change i just don't want any one of us to miss something that will be of help as we continue with the journey into 2024 i want to start by saying age is a number When you are 20, you think 50 is old. When you are 50, you feel 30. When you are 70, 50 looks adolescence. Our chronological age doesn't have to define us. Don't allow a number to hold you back or prevent you from being the person you are inside. Just be the person you are inside. Secondly, Vulnerability heals. Being real, open, and vulnerable invites people in and allows them to relate to you on a much deeper and more intimate level. Vulnerability practiced with safe and lovely people can heal emotional pain and strengthen relationships. Let down your walls and connect. It's surprisingly liberating. Three, remember that posturing builds walls. Creating a persona to impress or shield yourself from pain diminishes intimacy and authenticity. People generally see through this and it pushes them away and you look like a fool. Four, exercise is power. Exercise should be a daily priority for everyone. It makes you physically, mentally, and emotionally stronger. It improves your health and your outlook. It is a panacea for just about everything. 5. Grudges cause pain. Holding on to a grudge is like injecting poison into your body every day. Forgive and let go. There is no other way. If your eagle is preventing you from forgiving and letting something go, then tell your ego to take a hike. It's getting in the way of your happiness and well-being. 6. Passion upgrades life. When you find that thing you love and you do with all your heart, every day feels like a gift. If you haven't found your life passion, make it your mission to find it. The joy it brings you spills over into all aspects of your life. 7. Remember, you aren't always right. We think we have the answers and know what's right and wrong, good and bad, and best for ourselves and other people. But we aren't always right. There is always more than one version. There are many perspectives that are valid. Always remember this life lesson and keep yourself open to the truth. 8. Remember that it will pass. Whatever is causing you worry or pain right now won't cause you worry and pain forever. Time heals. Things change. It will pass. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, World without end. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son 
and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good night, as it dreams. Same to you, Father. I am not who I once was. I am freedom's prize. On the far side of the sea, above celestial shores, I am seated with my King, who reigns forevermore. I may not know much, but I know this: the Lord's a promise keeper, and I'm His. He is fierce. He is grace. He wouldn't let me get away. One thing I've learned is He will never change. Jesus loves me, this I know. For the Bible tells me so. I have tested this again and again, but I am His and He is mine. He'll prove it till the end of time and forever. Lord's a promise.